Hello, this is Professor Grant Thrall. There are many ways in which to calculate a trade area. In real estate market analysis, step one is to calculate a trade area. Which is the appropriate way to calculate a trade area? And what are the differences of your calculations because of your assumptions? On the screen, you see different ways to calculate a trade area. Radius. Second is a county boundary or a multi-county boundary. It has core-based statistical areas. Well, these are convenient political jurisdictions, but they may not be accurate with respect to trade. Next is we have distance bands. These are driving distance from this Butler Plaza. So we have increments of five miles, and the driving distance can be easily converted into drive time. And here we have the Bornithesian polygon, uh, where you are closer to this destination than any of the other competing destinations in the aggregate trade area. What are the differences of calculating a trade area? And once we do calculate the trade area polygon, then what are we going to do with it? We'll now calculate around the competitive super regional shopping centers in north central Florida in southern Georgia. We do that by making our highway node the working layer and then select by pointing and click on each of these competitive super regional shopping centers and that will select a highway node near that location and we'll use highways as our working layer. We go to tools, routing, network bands and we'll go out a distance of 40 miles in five mile increments. and then we'll rearrange our order of the draw so the last polygon drawn is the just calculated network bands. I drew the network bands around each of the competing mall and rec recall from previous videos that the network band 5 to 10 miles out on each one of these centers is going to be part of the same family of polygons. So select one, I select all of them for example, here is information, and we notice that all of the polygons switched on, and this is for the 10 to 15 mile radius. Now we will calculate a radial ring around e make competitive malls, do our analysis working layer, tools, geographic analysis, bands, and we can at this time also perform an overlay but we'll delay on doing an overlay for another time and we can calculate say 30 mile bands around each of the centers. Okay we have uh, now our distance bands around each center make our bands the working layer we can have as a uh, border color we'll pick it and make it uh, uh, fairly wide and there's our distance bands working layer. I will click on information and notice that when I selected information all of these are then part of the same agglomerated family of polygons. Distance bands, but this can be useful especially when we're deriving the uh, population around comparable places, comparable shopping centers and we would like to know what are the population characteristics in a given radius of each shopping center. <clears throat> now we'll calculate our area of geographic dominance. In other words, you're closer to one center than any of the other competing centers. Make working layer as the competitive malls in North Florida, South Georgia, tools, geographic analysis, areas of influence and so we're going to call this Voronai and I'm not going to calculate an overlay this time around. And here is our competing trade areas but uh, of course there's a lot out here in the Gulf and we're really only interested in the one in the center. So with this as the working layer, edit, tools, map editing, toolbox, 
click on the uh, red circle with the line through it. One, two, three, four, green light. Delete those polygons. Now with my Florida boundary here in the dark whiter brown, and tools, and geographic utilities, and I'm going to clip by area. So I've got my layer, which is my Voronoi polygon, and I'm going to clip that to my 1-2, which is the PIPS code for the state of Florida, Florida boundary. Add the layer to the map. Give this layer a name. And now I will hide previous, and now we have this calculated area of geographic predominant. different ways of calculating a trade area.